Action. Well, I guess I'm by myself today. Boo! Wow, look at the two chefs that popped up. That was their grand entrance, guys. We're going to cook. But the gloves should not be touching your face. You touching everything, now your hand, now the gloves are not clean. It's as simple as that. We are cooking with green chefs. That's the bag. It's gonna have all the good ingredients, right? Yes. So you guys might have seen our other cooking videos. Some of our other cooking videos with HelloFresh. And we love both companies. We love Green Chef and HelloFresh, like super easy, convenient meal options. And today, um, I don't know what she's doing, a Michael Jackson countdown. <laughs> <laughs> this girl and this girl will be cooking pretty much by themselves. They're going to take these instructions that come with the Green Chef meal option. And by the way, guys, Green Chef is a certified organic company. Are you serious? Guys, I know I'm sitting on the counter, but I'm filming the video, but I want to say that I'm going to be the one eating this meal. I know it's going to be good because Green Chef sends over great ingredients, and all the, all the girls got to do is follow these simple instructions. It's easy. Even Jersey could do it. No. He doesn't no. want to, though. He, he wants to watch he iPad. Jersey so, Jersey, man, you don't want to help cook? You in here chilling on the iPad, right? In your dad's office? All right, buddy. So, the reason that we believe that these girls can actually make this meal is because Green Chef makes cooking really, really easy. So like step-by-step -step instructions and it has chef's tips it has a photo guide so it's not just instructions like there's pictures so if you guys can't read you know in case you forgot how to read of course we can read we are already almost at fourth fifth grade level and, wow, okay. and but i have a question what if somebody can't read and they need a new no what to have i was just kidding if you can't yeah. read at all i don't think you should be doing a recipe you probably just cook by your own you know that yeah. would be bad because that means you wouldn't be able to see if you can't read that's not what that means so you girls are going to go ahead and, do it. and make sure that you follow these instructions you know it looks like there's only seven instructions eight no eight is cook put it on your plate and eat it i don't think you need to be instructed to do that <laughs> <laughs> so first step was what Preheat the oven to 425. Here's a pro tip. Preheat your oven as soon as you know you're cooking so you won't have to wait like, oh, I have to preheat, it's gonna take forever. Okay, pro tip, there you go. Alexa, do you have any pro tips? Um, do it. Do it! Just do it! <laughs> okay, great. Everything's in the back. You get a bit here. I get food. So my big question is, where's the chicken? Well, the chicken came with it as well, but I put the chicken in the fridge until we were ready to start uh, So cooking. now we got all the veggies and everything here, right? Yes. In case you guys are wondering, some of you may not eat chicken, like we're making a chicken meal. Green Chef has a variety of options to meet like anybody's lifestyle. Vegan and vegetarian options. Fast and fit options, you know what that means? It's fast, but it's yeah. not like unhealthy. Ooh! Wow, boom, good, boom, job. Boom. good job. They have Mediterranean options, you know, people who like that type of food. And oh, they have gluten-free options. So whatever it is that you like, like I'm not judging you. I'm not it. saying you gotta like this or that, but whatever you like. They got it. Whatever you want, Green Chef has got it. You know what your dad has got it? Uh, appetite, I got it, I got an appetite. So I want to satisfy that appetite. Let's get to it. What's step one? Let's step one, let's do it. So the first step is rinsing everything, right? Making sure it's clean, is that important? Yep, I'm polishing it. Without shoes, Alexis, they're potatoes. You don't need to polish them. So we're washing everything. Step one, preheat, we already did that. And now we are rinsing and we're about to dice up the potatoes and cut off the stem of the green beans. So Alexis, you got the beans here. What are you doing with the beans? I'm cutting the stems off because I, I, it's too hard for me to rip it off. And is that a kid knife? Yes, it's Just a making kid knife. sure. Ava, you doing the same thing? Yep, yeah, kid knife. Okay. It's going to take much longer to use a knife. Look, you do it like this, you pull it right off. You see how you just did it? No, I didn't pull because it, right it was already off. cut a little bit. Listen, I'm telling you, just pull it right off. So I am dicing the potatoes because it's hard to do and I do not want them cutting their fingers off trying to dice these hard potatoes. Yeah, fingers are important. <laughs> but the potatoes look good. So how are we doing over here with the beans? Good. Good. All right, you guys got almost all the stems off? Okay, mm -hmm. all right. One of my favorite things about meal kits like Green Chef is that it kind of like helps you have some time doing activity with your family. Like I like showing the girls how to do stuff and letting them think they're doing it on their own. Did you see the wink? Yeah. Holy moly. Stop it. No? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> 
So if you guys want to try Green Chef for yourself, make sure to use our code MIGHTY5130 for $130 off. You heard right. $130. Ooh, yes. you better get that. And that's not it. Like, you'll get free shipping on your first box as well. So $130 off. So the second step is putting the potatoes in the pot, the medium-sized pot. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Put the water in so it's at least two inches above the potatoes. There we go. Cover the potatoes. And then lightly salt a little bit, right? Mm-hmm. Sea okay. salt. This is the art of cooking, right? There you go. There you okay. go. Okay. Alexis. Go ahead and look at step three. I'll be right there. And, and here we go. Ava, you got it on the stove, right? Okay, good job. Good job. You hear that sound? You know it's going. But now we want to bring that to a boil, right? So when it's bubbling? You got that right. When this is bubbling, that means it's boiling. So Alexis, what do we got for step three? Place breadcrumbs and chopped cheddar cheese in a small bowl. Drizzle with two to, to three teaspoons of oil, olive oil. Lightly season with salt and pepper. Ooh, okay. A lot of Start to come back. And then bread Ava time. could do the salt and pepper, and I'll start. Okay. Two to three teaspoons of oil. It I'll says it right. Alexis. I was just telling you. Alexis. I was just. <laughs> so get the oil, the, the little scrap of oil we have left. <laughs> Hold your spoon flat. Otherwise, when you pour the oil, it's gonna slip down. Okay. Hold the spoon flat. Two. And just put the third one. We'll just go ahead and do the third one. Good. Three. So we got the breadcrumbs and the cheese and the olive oil, and now we're putting some salt and pepper. And Alexis, you're going to stir this up nice and good? Mm-hmm. Yeah, there you go. Ooh. That should be good. That salt okay. looks like sea salt. There you go. All right. So let's go to step four, so Ava. Step what is it? Pat chicken cut cuttles. Dry cut with paper cutlets. Cut cut Dry with paper towels, season with salt and pepper, place chicken on a lightly oiled, foil lined baked baking sheet, spread Creole Diagnosi Sayed <laughs> over Dijon. tops of Dijon over tops of chicken. Spoon spoon breading over tops of chicken. Press to add add here. Okay, so mama's getting the chicken ready, right? Yep, get it out for the kids. Look where it's coming out. It'll spray her face. You gotta press it all the way down. Okay, can I? <coughs> exactly. She just pressed out the fumes. <laughs> <laughs> You're still doing the same. Okay, Ava, stop. You're still just pressing out the fumes. I don't even know how she's doing that. Let's go set up the alarm, guys. You can't do it the yeah, Alexis There you go. It. Okay, oh, all right, all right. Alexis all right. like a little fire extinguisher over here. She's putting out the fire. Jeez. Okay. Oh my gosh. So, each of you get your chicken okay. and put it on one oh, spot. Oh, this feels so good. Okay, let's get the chicken. Home. Chicken. Remember, this is I'm gonna eat this chicken. I have to salt and pepper the chicken. Okay, salt and pepper the chicken. Let's do it. Good job. Okay. I don't wanna eat some of this chicken. No, let's turn it over. Uh -huh. And you can do oh, well, pepper this side and Lexi salt this side. Why can't I eat then we turn this it over. chicken? Like when it's cooked. I'm with that. Of course you're gonna eat it. Alright, this is looking good. That's enough. Enough. I'm putting Dijonet in there. Dijonet? <laughs> like as a person. Okay, Creole Dijonet. Can you say that, Ava? Creole Dijonet. Okay, pretty good, pretty good. And what is that? That's like a nice sauce, right? Mm -hmm. That's like a good sauce. It's going to make it nice and yummy. Now, girls, remember, who's going to eat this? You. you. That's right. And us. Well, probably not. Probably just no, me, no, we're not. Probably just me. And now we're about to put these breadcrumbs on there. One at a time. It's not a competition. <laughs> Now pat it down on top of there. We'll see how this turns out. I feel like it's gonna be very salty the way they put that much salt. <laughs> so I just put everything in the oven. Okay, how long did I cook? 14 to 16 minutes. 14 to 16 minutes? Yep, okay, let's go to the next step, okay, while that's cooking. Okay. So now we're at step six, mashing the potatoes, I believe. Yep, I'm gonna bring the boiling hot potatoes. Boiling hot potatoes. Ooh, that's hot, right? Mm -hmm. 
So now we're going to mash the potatoes. Mash it up, mash it up, mash yeah, it up. Yeah, you can come bring the potatoes and put it back in the pot. There you go. Potato masher. Potato leftover water from the cooked potatoes that we're going to add back to the potatoes to mash. There you go. Mash it up, girl. Beat huh? it up. Get Get up. it. Take all that anger out. Take all that anger out. I don't have any anger. You don't? Take, take my anger out. I don't like mashed potatoes. Mash it up, mash it up, mash it up. Okay. Final step is Alexis is going to cook the string beans. The green beans. The string beans. I gotta let it get hot, but I got a little bit of cooking oil in there. Yeah, okay. And then we got our beans. We took the stems off, okay. This is hot oil. So when you're putting these in there, you can't drop them. You don't want hot oil to splash on you, right? You see how I'm gonna put it in? One by one. No, you can grab a whole bunch. No. You wanna put them all in. Let's go ahead, beans. Ava's still mashing over here. How's the mashing going? Good. Mashing. It looks like mashed potatoes. All right, so mashing it up good. All right. Don't touch the pot, Alexis. There we go. Okay, and then here, I'm going to let you spray a little bit more cooking oil on top. Three to four minutes over here. Sounds good. I like how the beans are going. Let's check on the chicken. How's it doing? Good. Let's check it out. Oh, it's done, right? Yep. Done. Okay. Chicken's done. Look at all that extra stuff we spilled. That you spilled because you dropped well, the pan. Yeah. yeah, let's talk about let's talk about the stuff around the chicken. And Ava, are the potatoes mashed up good? Yep, I think they look like it. Yeah. Okay. So when this is done cooking in like two minutes, just throw the tomatoes in and everything's done. Ready? Tomatoes on top of the on top of the green beans. I don't know what that is. On top of the green beans? Yep. A few moments later. I'm making Dennis plate. <laughs> That's my plate? Ooh, that looks good. Does it look good? I think it looks really good. Look at what we got there. We got potatoes, we got the chicken, we got the beans with the tomato. The tomato kind of looks like watermelon. It looks like watermelon a little bit, but it's tomato for sure. Oh, Ava, that's enough potato. That's, that's enough, that's, that's enough, that's, that's enough. enough. Girls are trying to give me a carb heart attack or something, but I'm gonna eat this meal, guys. I'm excited. Let me show it to you again. Look at this. I'm gonna eat this meal. Thank you, Green Chef. I'm gonna hold this up like a trophy, guys. Like a, like a trophy. I'm gonna eat this. And girls, I think you did a good job. You followed instructions well. And there's enough for you girls to eat too if you want. So definitely eat some chicken. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. I'm gonna enjoy this meal. Yes. yes. Peace. Thank you for watching. And make sure you do more videos. Subscribe and so on the more of cases. Thank you for watching.